Hello, my name is Remy Du. I'm a science teacher here at Miami Christian School in Miami, Florida. Let's talk a little bit about what's a space-time continuum. Most people have heard that word, you know, when watching Star Trek or, or maybe reading some science fiction novel. And a space-time continuum is simply the dimensions of space combined with the dimension of time. When we think of space, we usually think of three dimensions, length, width, and height. And these three dimensions are intertwined. You cannot separate them. Uh, that's what we refer to as 3D. Uh, when we go watch a 3D movie, uh, it's not really 3D. It's only an illusion of 3D because the movie itself is in two dimensions, which is just width and height. But reality is in three dimensions. And most people don't understand that time is also intrinsically embedded into those three dimensions. In other words, the three dimensions of space and the dimension of time come together to form one dimension called basically a space-time continuum. Believe it or not, Albert Einstein's teacher learned uh, from Albert Einstein's work and it was he that really developed a lot of the uh, theories or uh, behind what a space-time continuum really is. And some experiments have shown that space and time are related. Uh, when objects are traveling at really high velocities through space, the time literally slows down. And if you were traveling in space at nearly the speed of light in a spaceship, uh, let's say, uh, you would age slower than someone on Earth. Uh, this is actually due to the fact that space and time are interrelated.